This video will consist of two methods to get Shopify data to Looker Studio. Method 1. Get Shopify data to Looker Studio using two-minute reports. Method 2. Get Shopify data to Looker Studio using templates. Click on Accounts to move on to the Accounts portal. Choose your team if you are in any. From the list of connectors, choose Shopify. You will land into the Data Sources section. Click on Add New to start creating your new Shopify data source. Start naming your data source and choose the app type between store admins or Shopify partners. From your Shopify admin portal, generate the access token. Copy-paste it in the below section. Finally, add your store name and click on Save. Now head over to the Query Configs tab. Click on Add New and choose your required data source that you've already created. Set a configuration and click on Save. Now let's create that report. Click on Create Report. Select the query configuration you want to use and click on Next. From the Create Report tab, click on Create Report from scratch to open Looker Studio. Choose the team and click on Next. Verify your configurations and click on Connect. Here, you will have all the fields you have for your Shopify report. Add, eliminate, or modify any field based on your requirements. Click on Create Report at the top right corner. Confirm this action by clicking on Add to Report. You now have all the metrics and dimensions available on the sidebar to add to the report. Select Date Range Control under the Date filter. Choose a range or click on the duration in the drop-down menu. Just under dimensions, pick and choose from various options like average order value, customers count, new customer, order count, returning customers, etc. Now, let's explore metrics. You can check the drop-down to explore all the metrics like gross sales amount, net sales amount, discount amount, and much more available for your report. Also, note that for both dimensions and metrics, there are two ways to add them. Drag and drop from the data sidebar column or pick one from the drop-down list. You also have various other options in the sidebar like primary sort, secondary sort, filters, and much more. Method 2. Get Shopify data to Looker Studio using templates. Repeat the first few steps, adding a data source and a query config. Then click on Create Report to open the Creating New Data Studio Report window. Then select Shopify. Click on Next. Now you will find built-in templates tailored specifically for Shopify. Select the one that suits your needs and connect Shopify to Looker Studio. Once Looker Studio opens up, choose the team, then click on Next and pick your query configurations. Click on Connect at the top right corner. Here comes the customization. You'll see all the fields for your Shopify reporting. Add or eliminate fields and parameters as needed. Click on Create Report. To set the dates, use the drop-down menu to select the date range manually. You can also customize the duration or choose from the available options. You can edit the charts by just selecting the chart and modifying its fields as shown here. Now, sit back and let Looker Studio arrange all the Shopify metrics and data, creating insightful reports for your analysis.